One of the most beautiful aspects of working in Microsoft Teams is the ability that all members of the team can edit or co-author a document at the same time. Let me show you how. I'm gonna start a conversation here and I'm gonna add a file. So let's upload it from my computer. Let's go to my courses. Let's go to Teams. So I'm gonna add a file. In this example, it's gonna be called Bodmas. The green line has gone through which means it's uploaded. And this is now uploaded to the channel called Management Team. Now, everybody who's a member of Happy People can access this document. So how can we start co-authoring? Well, I'm gonna open the document, click on the ellipsis and open it in. Now you've got a couple of options. We can open it in Teams, we can open it in Word, and we can open it in a browser. With co-authoring or editing, it's a matter of choice. If I open it in Teams, I will not get the same full editing rights that I have on the full-blooded desktop version. So it just depends. If it's something quick, this will be fine. On my other machine, I now need to go to my other machine and this person will need to open the document as well. And they can open it in any way they wish to do so. So now look on this screen very carefully. My name's Paul, but John Smith has now appeared in this document. If you look at the blue cursor, this is my cursor for John Smith. And I can now type in on my other machine John saying hi. And that's how you can co-author and co-edit at the same time using Microsoft Teams. Just to show you the second version, I'm gonna open the document again, but this time I'm gonna open it in the desktop version. This gives me the full-blooded version of what I can do. Again, my cursor is here, John Smith is here, but this gives me the full range of editing abilities in Microsoft Word. Ladies and gentlemen, that's why I love Microsoft. I do hope you've enjoyed this short video, found it useful. Please like the video if you found it useful, and in the comments, let me know what type of videos would you like me to start preparing for you? Thank you very much.